RealAgriculture.com presents The Dairy School. You can find more great dairy content at dairyschool.ca. Bernard Tobin here for Real Agriculture. We're near Moncton, Ontario today, joined by Mike and Teresa Portina. They have just built a brand new 40 stall herringbone rotary parlor here and we're standing in the middle of it and it's an amazing facility. I just want to talk to these folks about, you know, the investment, the commitment to a, a, a piece of a technology like this and maybe, uh, Teresa, just talk about, as I say, a little bit about your farm and your family first of all. Obviously, um, as I say, um, you're committed for the long term. Yeah. Yeah, we started uh, farming in 97 and uh, we have four kids, we have uh, two girls, two boys and we started with 80 cows and we expanded uh, first, we started with a double six, then we expanded to a double nine, then a double twelve. Uh, when our kids got older, they wanted to be involved. Our daughter went to mm. school to be a herdary person. Right. So she decided she wanted to come home and she said, well, the milking was taking too long. It was taking about four, right now it's taking about four hours. So we want to shorten the milking, that it goes a lot quicker. And for our kids to be more involved too. And, uh, uh, and we have a lot of, uh, we have a couple full times and yep. we have uh, part time. So we're hoping between all of us that we can do a lot of stuff ourselves. Right. Uh, because right now we don't milk because the shift takes so long and there's too much other stuff that has to be done. Mm. So we're hoping that if the shift is a lot shorter that we can be more involved in the milking. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. Now Mike, this is, this is pretty much a dream come true here. This is a pretty uh, amazing facility. You know, um, how big is the operation right now? How many cows are you milking? We have the dairy herd is 500 cows. 500. So around 420 milking. Yeah. And now, will this uh, facility allow you to further expand? Yes, that's the reason we did it. We hope to buy extra quota, or get more quota in the near future. We right. like to go up to 600 cows. Well, awesome. That's, awesome. We, we can milk that many cows. So that's the, the game plan. Right. And, and that's the reason we we could have gone with a smaller rotary, but. For future expansion, we thought it was a smart move right. to, to max right away. Do it once and do it good. Right, so we've got a family operation here, committed to the future, sees a bright future. So, Mike, I'll ask you a question, um, an obvious one probably. You know, why a parlor rather than robots? We like to uh, get the milk done hmm. in a fast, efficient way. Right. I'm not the kind of person who wants to sit fetch cows all day or sit behind a computer. So, and we saw at my brother's place who milks with a rotary for about six, seven or eight years. We saw a good cow flow, easy on the cows instead of the, the longer parallel pilots, which takes a lot longer to load mm. and unload. So we thought this was with a round crowd gate, a smooth, smooth thing to do that it, it, it flows better, I think, than a normal pilot. We are going to go to Steve Shea uh, from Duke Laval, who's going to give us a tour of this parlor. Here we are in a 40 cow DLL internal rotary at Wendelin Holsteins. This is where they're going to milk their 425 cows three times a day with two people. Throughput on this rotary is between 160 and 200 cows an hour. That's the advantage of a rotary, milking cows fast and comfortably for the operator. We're here at the command center for the rotary parlor. This is where the cows get milked and the operator has full control over everything on the rotary parlor with the touch screen. The touch screen shows every cow on the rotary. They get identified with their ear tag as they come onto the rotary. If there is something abnormal for milking, you'll hear the voice alarm. Not only that, you can hit the stall and you can sort and separate a cow automatically when she's done milking. Similar to how we uh, coax cows into the robot for milking with grain, we have the teaser feed manger. When the cow gets identified, our Dell Pro farm management software drops a little bit of grain for each cow, as small as 15 grains per cow. It helps to get the cows onto the rotary and they're comfortable. Our D Lavelle rotary, the HBR herringbone rotary internal, is built in Europe. Standard, it comes in all galvanized material. We've upgraded a few of the key back end of the parlor rump rail to stainless steel, the splash pan, and all the lower skirting to stainless steel for cleanliness and durability. And you can see the wash tray folds down for when we're done milking to clean in place. 
the cows all have rubber to stand on when they're milking, which is nice and comfortable. And the big option on this rotary is an arm takeoff. Arm takeoffs make this rotary a one person machine because the claw is under the cow, held by an arm, so there's no squawks, no slips or fall offs, and it's very easy to milk cows.